AMIA and Porter Airlines now forming a new Aeroplan partnership. The agreement will come into effect after AMIA's partnership with Air Canada ends in July of 2020. And joining us now live over the phone is Michael DeLuce, the Executive Vice President and Chief Commercial Officer for Porter Airlines. Michael, thank you so much for joining us. Good morning. Thanks for having me. So can you just break down for the millions of people who currently collect Aeroplan miles and they weren't sure what was going to happen with them, what will happen now uh, when it comes to Porter? So two weeks ago, um, Aeroplan announced her vision for 2020, which was going to be a significant enhancement to the overall program where Aeroplan holders will be able to redeem their points for multitude of airlines around the world. And uh, today we announced a comprehensive partnership with Aeroplan where Porter would uh, become an issuing partner. So when you fly on Porter flights after July 2020, you'll be able to earn Aeroplan points. But equally, uh, when you're redeeming flights, you'll now have that option in July 2020 to redeem your points on Porter flights. And we're providing Aeroplan a substantial amount of seat inventory to allow them to uh, and their car members to redeem flights on a low fixed cost basis. Okay, and with uh, this deal, it came to us a bit of a surprise. We did know that AMIA was in talks with Air Canada previously to become, uh, or at least for a takeover, that was declined earlier this week. And now this, we're, have you been in talks for quite some time, or is this something that just kind of developed? Yes, we've been talking with uh, Aeroplan for quite some time. And you know, several weeks ago when they announced their enhanced vision for the program, uh, talks did intensify and, and obviously there was events that unfolded over the last week between the consortium and Aeroplan, but, but this has been in motion for quite some time and we're excited to be part of it. All right, and I, I know that it's early right now and everything has to be ironed out, but in terms of how people will be able to collect and also redeem these points, is it going to be similar to the, the current plan or can any members expect, uh, you know, some shifts, I guess, when it comes to the amounts? That need to be used? I know we anticipate that the same low fixed cost uh, mileage uh, requirements will be used on Porter flights. I think the big difference that consumers are going to see is substantial enhancement of the inventory available. So you'll no longer need to sort of be flexible and hunt uh, for flights. And we're going to be providing Aeroplan members the ability to redeem flights on, you know, as much as 60% of our inventory will be at low fixed cost uh, point issuance. All right, Michael, thank you so much for joining us once again. I appreciate it. Great. Thanks very much. Again, that's Michael DeLuce from Porter Airlines.